Hello and welcome to the MAC weather page for this Thursday, March 8th, and the headlines, winter storm warnings, winter weather advisories continue in the Thumb area. We'll have a pretty snowy day with maybe up to another six inches of snow, especially in Huron County. And if we look at the headlines, about trace to maybe two inches as you get towards mid-Michigan, two to six inches in northeastern lower Michigan. Looks like a pretty decent weekend. We'll have more in the way of sunshine. Temperatures will climb into the mid-30s at least, maybe even upper 30s. And then we are looking at another clipper system next week. Right now, we don't see this as a big system, but it's going to do is reinforce the cold air next week will be uh, below normal temperatures. We may have some better news as far as that goes uh, in the extended period, and we'll show you that in a moment. Normal high is 38, the normal low is 20. And uh, yesterday, we had a high of 30, a low of 24, about six hundredths of an inch of precipitation, six tenths of an inch of snow. So far, we have about two and a half inches of snow on the ground this morning. Our storm total was 2.6 up to 41.4 inches of uh, snow so far for the season. And you can see a breakdown of the snow if you go to the website. All this will be available there, but you can see we've had 62 days with at least one inch of snow on the ground, 33 days with at least four inches of snow on the ground, and we've had eight uh, days where we had eight or more inches of snow on the ground, and we've had no days where we've had a foot of snow on the ground. You can see temperatures out there this morning, mainly in the low to mid, or low to mid 20s, and again, uh, winter storm warnings in the Thumb area, winter weather advisories over in the Brown City area in Marlette. And you can see if we look at the uh, weather map this morning, that low pressure system yesterday was over Western Lake uh, Erie. That's moved due north, and then we've got a pivoting uh, trough that'll come through the area. That'll bring some pretty good snowfalls, again, to the Thumb area, but it'll also bring enhanced convective type snow showers, I think, as we get into later in the, this morning into the afternoon during the heating. So we could have some pretty good bursts of snow showers across the area. That should uh, continue to whiten the ground up a little bit more. As far as the radar, you can see that all pivoting around that storm system over Lake Huron. And again, I think we'll have one more or pretty good uh, day of uh, snow showers. And then finally, the system will lift off to the east as we get into tomorrow. How much snowfall? The WPC says much of the uh, center part of the state off to the northeast will pick up uh, at least one to three inches of snow. And again, some of your heavier snowfall amounts in northeast lower Michigan and or in the Thumb area. If we look at the extended outlook, you can see finally as we get towards the end of the 6 to 10 day period, probably day 8, 9, and 10, we'll see at least normal temperatures begin to move into the area as that trough uh, begins to shift out in the Atlantic. And you can see the new trough in the 8 to 14 day gets itself established out west. And that's going to be warmer temperatures for the Great Lakes, drier than normal across the 6 to 10 day outlook. But then we begin to see more in the way of a zonal flow here in the 8 to 14 day that's going to bring a lot of Pacific moisture across the U.S. Doesn't look like tremendously heavy rain, but certainly a good chance we could be above normal rainfall during that period. And now the forecast looks like today highs in the mid-30s right down through the weekend. We're going to drop down into the teens though as we get uh, into the weekend with some clear skies that allow uh, temperatures to fall, especially with snow cover on the ground. And again, snow showers today and then maybe a clipper system bringing some light snow in Monday. we got time to look at that system, but behind that's going to be a reinforcing shot of cold air for much of next week. As far as weather walks this morning, you can see the uh, winter weather advisories and winter storm warnings across much of northeastern lower Michigan. And again, uh, after today, I think things calm down quite a bit and we'll have a nice weekend on tap. Thanks for stopping by and have yourself a great day and 73s to all.